hot cabana salad. Hi and welcome to Cheeky Richo's cabana salad. We're going to cook the cabana and layer it on top of our crisp salad and coat it in a pungent mustard spicy sauce. The ingredients will be in the recipe box below. So let's get started. The first thing we're going to do to amalgamate our flavours is add our prepared salad dressing, our Dijon mustard and our whole egg mayonnaise to a bowl. And we are just going to whisk this with enough apple cider vinegar to loosen it up to make it into a nice dressing. A couple of splashes, probably looking at about 20 grams or up. That's fine. Now we're going to chop our cabana into chunks about 10 to 15 mil. And we're going to fry these off and caramelize the outside of them and get some of the oil out of them which will emit while it's cooking. Just some little rings here. And we're just going to fry our cabana, our smoked cabana, until it browns slightly over a low heat and we will remove the fat because the fat does not need to go into the salad. Okay, our cabana is cooked now. We're just going to put the paper towel into the pan and absorb any of the extra oil that has come out of the meat. So it's actually quite lean. And we're going to set that to one side just while we assemble the balance of our salad. Okay, we've sliced our celery up into reasonable sized slice in with our spring onions, which have also been sliced, along with our carrots. Same thing, it's all been sliced up, that all over the top. Our corn goes on next, followed by our cheese. Now we layer our cabana over the top of that. One more quick whiz of our dressing. If you need to thin it a little more, do so. But once this hits the hot cabana, it will probably thin down a little as the mayonnaise melts. So you don't want it too runny. And there you have it, Cheeky Richo's hot cabana salad. Hope you enjoyed this little video demonstration. If you'd like to see more recipes and ideas, please check out my Cheeky Richo channel. And please subscribe, leave a comment or a recipe request. If we can get the ingredients, we will try and make it for you. Do come back and visit us again soon. We have so much more to show you. And thank you very much for watching. Have a lovely day. Let's serve some of this up, shall we? Get a little bit of everything for everybody. And that is a truly satisfying meal. Thanks for watching.